YouTube, it's Star. Hello YouTube, this is Miss Gumbo. Okay, if you guys saw Talk Sex Part 1, 2, and 3, you will see at the end of 3 that we left off with her talking about kissing. So, we're going to finish that up. Kissing. Kissing. Kissing to me is something very sensual. Kissing you is all that I'm to do. I'm going to it. Y'all in there back there? Okay, we're in the You know what I'm saying? Get down like that. But it's, kissing is a very sensual thing between two people, whether it's man and woman, woman and woman, and man and man. Okay? Honey, kissing is a very beautiful thing. And I, me, myself, with these big ass lips. Baby, I love to kiss. Okay. Girl, somebody told me you had some DSLs. But that's another topic. Okay. What, what? Anywho, you know what I'm saying? I, I mean, a person, like, I could be, like, so infatuated with a person and so into a person. But if they cannot kiss, don't you know that just turns me so off? That's, like, the wackest thing. Like, who doesn't know how to kiss anymore? You know what I'm saying? And, like, for example... Um, oh, you know what I can't say? What is that? When they cover your whole mouth with their mouth. And then, like, it be spit all on your chin, your neck, and dripping on your chest. And then yeah. two hours later, you still smelling that backwash. Oh, God. Oh, girl. It be smelling like, it be smelling like somebody drug that cat across your chin, or somebody uh laid a dead rat on your chin and then didn't tell you, and then they should be funky. <laughs> And then it smell like uh, a skunk that put in your mouth and then uh, wipe okay. his ass cheek with your cheek. No, baby. Right. But, um, oh, no, when you kiss someone <clears throat> and after this a very sensual transaction, it seemed like this person deliberately sucked up all the saliva out of their saliva glands. Even threw up a little bit in their mouth just to get okay. a little extra wet. And, and glued it on your chin. And then glued it on your chin just to, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Just to, um... Put it in yours. But, but if I want to say that in a very intellectual way, what would I say? Well, just to put their spit in your mouth. What if transaction? Yes, that transaction. The transference. I mean, of. <laughs> I mean, it, it just seemed like they wanted you to have every, every molecule in their body in your mouth. That it has to be the nastiest. I felt like someone had spat a noogie in my mouth. That was disgusting. I thought it was a loogie. Is it loogie or noogie? I'm going to have to ask YouTube. YouTube, is it loogie, loogie or noogie? Okay, we need to know this because I've been saying noogie for like the longest. But anyway, or like another thing that makes me mad is like it seems like a person is like so anxious to kiss you and they're just biting on your gums. This is how I like to kiss, you know, a peck, peck, and then get into the French kiss. Yes. yes, but damn, some people just like, you know, I I'm pecking and... You trying to bite my like, say for instance. No, look, I'm pecking. You trying to bite my damn head out. That ain't cool. Say for instance, you know. You two gonna talk about me, okay? Say for instance, uh, where's my baby? At? My baby in here? She back? Yeah. I need a demonstration, a dummy. You know, bring bring guests on, my man. Okay. You two, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna share something with you guys because this is like really a pet peeve, okay? So many people compliment me on my lips and her lips, and it's like, wow, you don't even know what to do with it. You wouldn't see me in there with uh, uh, John Jack and Jingle having Smith sitting on my wall. Now, you girl, I mean, you girls. <laughs> Sorry, somebody's on my mind. Now, don't be alarmed, okay? He's very, very special to me. And um, what I'm going to do right now, you two, I'm going to demonstrate how I like to be kissed. <laughs> Now, you know, some people, this is going to be sick to some people, okay? But some people, you know, you like to, you know, work into it, you know? So it's like... Make sure you watch my baby over there. I know. But then, you know, you have some people, you know, like I said, they get like a little anxious and they're just... What are you doing to me? Okay? That's not right. That's not cool. You know, I, I and I just, I, I really never got that. And they just always talk about, oh, man, I'm just, man, these lips ain't here for nothing. And I know what to do with these lips. And don't you just hang with a person just build their selves up to. Oh, baby, it's like, you know this. <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. So you got a little mouth. 
be seen. And it's so cool. He's seen you in. Oh, I found it, girl. So, what's your pet peeve? Um, that's really it. Um, that's really it. People just don't know how to kiss. If you don't know how to kiss, just go on me. Oh, girl, I know. I oh, when they kissing. like kiss you on your neck and stuff, and then when you. You could just feel okay, especially, about a quart of spit. Not even that, but especially like, say you have the fan on right after they finish kissing your neighbor. And you smell their breath. Okay, just, you know what I'm saying? That shit is not cold. But oh you, you, you basically hit everything. Oh, oh no, I hate, it. I hate it when a person stick their tongue in my ear. I hate that too. It's okay to never kiss. Yeah, well, I'm not even just gonna make this about kissing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say what pisses me off about what a person does with their mouth. Okay. I kiss it. You know, just nibble. And another kiss thing, you know, what I'm saying, if you like licking ass, no offense, even though my ass might be clean, do not. I might be clean. <laughs> Damn, I just thought about them. Shit. Uh, but uh, don't lick, <laughs> don't lick ass and expect to get a, a kiss. Okay, make sure when you lick that ass, it's the very last thing you do. And then you get your ass.